Rainforests are full of some of the strangest, most dangerous, most miraculous and most beautiful animals in the world. But thanks to human activities, we're losing species at an unprecedented rate. How can we best protect them? Well, we do have national parks, but this ignores a sizable population of animals that live alongside people every day. In order to protect these animals, we have to understand the people they live with and how they may benefit or suffer from the way in which we use the forest. Traditionally, primates have been hunted by indigenous communities in South America to form part of their diet, often to the extent that large-bodied species such as woolly monkeys, spider monkeys and howler monkeys have been driven to local extinction. Small-bodied species, which may escape the worst of the hunting, are also regularly taken as pets, which may lead to high levels of stress in family groups and change the way they behave. Recent improvements in infrastructure and better access to markets has the potential to either exacerbate or reduce the problem. So understanding current attitudes and the way in which they are likely to change has become increasingly important. My research looks at hunting pressure, pressure from the pet trade and attitudes towards primates in the Ecuadorian rainforest in order to understand why species may come under threat and figure out ways in which we can target future education to make sure that monkeys stay alive and well for decades to come. My name is Kira and I'm a PhD student at the University of Manchester.